Hi, and welcome to Glass Class. Today we're gonna to be talking about what is a Cloud Access Security Broker, or a CASB. So in a typical enterprise environment today, we have a couple of big changes that are happening. They're moving data outside the firewall. First, we have uh, organizations adopting a series of both managed and unmanaged cloud-based applications. And at the same time, we have users' devices moving outside of corporate control. So we still have those managed devices, laptops, smartphones, what have you, that we've had for years uh, in the past. We have an increasing amount of, of BYOD. And so when we have a user, let's say, on a BYOD device connecting over a public network to a cloud-based application like Office 365 or Dropbox, there's a big security and compliance concern that the firewall cannot solve. So the way that CASB works is it integrates with backend applications to sit between the user on whatever device they're connecting into and the app itself, and it does that through a series of proxies and APIs. So proxies provide that connection uh, between uh, the user and the application itself and are able to protect data in real time. APIs integrate with the applications on the back end to scan and control data at rest. And once we have this infrastructure in place, there are a couple main functions around data and threat protection that a CASB can provide. First piece is data protection. Right, this is inclusive of things like access control, so controlling managed versus unmanaged device access, location control, et cetera. Uh, data leakage prevention, encryption, and, and the like. Threat protection. So threat helps solve and mitigate problems related to malware, uh, you know, credential compromise, a whole broad range of, of different types of threats that may be targeting enterprise applications in the cloud. Identity. So identity is really the cornerstone of the foundation of any strong uh, security story, especially when you move to the cloud, where you have things not only um, uh, integrating it with the identity on-premises, but single sign-on, step-up, multi-factor auth, uh, et cetera. And the last piece is visibility. So visibility provides everything from very detailed, you know, granular logging around uh, how the users are using these applications in the, in the cloud, uh, to more importantly, uh, user behavior analytics and other types of insights into what's actually going on that may be security relevant in your enterprise. So you com combine this architecture that, that intermediates connections between the user and the backend cloud application in a comprehensive set of security functions, and that is a cloud access security broker. Thanks for joining Glass Class.